Following last Thursday's announcement that all Georgians over 16 are now eligible for the COVID-19 vaccine, Berry College partnered with Floyd Medical Center to vaccinate students on campus on March 31st and April 1st. Although the vaccine is now available to all, some students have reported concerns about the vaccine quality due to its quick development. However, Jamie Say, Barry's clinical professor of nursing, said the speed of a vaccine's creation doesn't necessarily signal how safe it is. The fact that it was faster doesn't mean that um, safety aspects of it were skipped. There was just that sort of red tape that was lifted um, because it was so urgent. Despite possible concerns, many students are taking advantage of the on-campus vaccinations. Floyd Medical Center's Director of Corporate Health, Chris Butler, said that 661 students signed up for vaccination on Wednesday alone. Butler said this high participation rate comes from the benefits of the partnership between Barry and Floyd. Providing something on site really reduces that barrier to access, meaning that, well, do I have to schedule an appointment? Do I have to get in my car? Do I have to wait in line? And when you bring it on campus where you have a captured audience of, of a certain number of population, your, your number of participation increases. Just like when we go on site in local business and industry, when you have a captured audience of 300 people there, you know you're probably going to get a high participation rate. According to Say, students should consider getting their vaccines to speed the process of returning to normal, which experts say will happen when 75 to 85 percent of Americans are vaccinated. So if you are healthy and you're comfortable with it, um, I would recommend getting it um, to protect those around you. With Viking Fusion News, I'm Annabelle Norton.